All right, that's Robert Reed Jr., our Tuesday guest analyst. And we've got one to go, the 11th and final field of eight, artistic pick, Magical Albert, Livin' Large, Kenny Joe, the Lone Ranger, Mercenary, Bet on Brett, Rolling Rock from the trailing tier, nine was scratched, a mile and a 16th, here they come. And they're off toward the inside, living large, artistic pick, and in between them, Magical Albert, as they tussle into the first turn. Pushing through from that inside spot is artistic pick, as Magical Albert parked out in the early going. Magical Albert now chased along to clear, and will grab the racetrack. Artistic pick second, caught wide third, and moving up is Mercenary through a quick opening quarter tempo. Livin' Large is just off the speed in fourth. Racing fifth, Kenny Joe, as they arrive at the quarter. Starting up early in the backfield, bet on Brett. Then it is the Lone Ranger and Rolling Rock can see them all from an eighth. The opening quarter in a brisk 27 and four. Plenty of speed to chase in this one, with Magical Albert and Austin Sorry working hard to make the lead. They'll take him up to the half-mile point. Drafting along the inside is Artistic Pick. Long mile and a 16th journey here for Mercenary. Out on cover is Bet on Brett. Third over in the flow now. As they race that lower turn comes the Lone Ranger. Shuffled on the inside. Living large, followed up by Kenny Joe, who's saving ground. And the trailer, as they move on to the back stretch, is Rolling Rock. Yeah, we're halfway home in a rock solid 57 and 1. Magical Albert still going and stretches the lead to a length and a half. Mercenary hangs around in second spot. Three wide out of the backfield. There goes the Lone Ranger. Down on the inside is Artistic Pick in between Pacers. Bet on Brett. Still hunting racing room. Both live in large and Kenny Joe. Rolling rock trails. Three quarters, 128 and 1. They come to the top of the stretch and they're going to have to do some pacing to catch Magical Albert trying to take it the distance, the lead, three lengths, Mercenary's got a huge one, he's holding second, the Lone Ranger living large from way back coming on, but Magical Albert found the wire in time, living large, and Kenny Joe both shook loose late, they were second and third respectively it appeared, and a photo for the rest, two, oh, four and four for the mile and the 16th. Top five finishers have been posted. It's a two, three, six, four, and five. Top five finish order. And here's the winner of the 11th and final, number two, Magical Albert, an eight-year-old gelded son of Mach 3 from the Camlock Mare Illusionist. Homebred of Dave Lumsden of Ancaster. Anthony Beaton is the winning trainer. Austin Sorry doing the driving. Guiding the gelding to his first win of the season. Eighth career victory. And wins at the added distance of a mile and a 16th and 204 and 4 fifths.